This is on the cover dudes. But it's CJ or so Frosty Wolf here. Strems here. It's Konik, so it is your boy 47. It's Zed here. It's your boy Huggy here. It is your boy that presses you. Yo, what's going on, YouTube? Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Welcome to another commentary on my channel. Hello. It's me. With that said, bang. <laughs> like, come on. This is like. Why is this allowed? Why is this allowed? Like, stop. There we go. 40 kill gameplay with a shotgun. Highly skilled gameplay. Another Kings. Dude, lore. The game's just like, okay, you're in lore. So therefore, you're going to get unlimited lore skins. Oh, oh my god. Contra. Contra. Let's go. Streamer luck off on. It's on. Oh my god. It's on. Lovely. I love it when my streamer luck's on. All right. Oh my god, it's actually on! It's actually on! It's actually- <laughs> No stopping until the very end. This is the rapid fire round. Let's go and do it. Purchase one. What do we get? No! Stream locks activate! <laughs> no way! I was going to scream. Not a contraband though, okay? So, uh, contraband right now? <gasps> Yo! That, that is the SMG skin I need! <laughs> Oh my god, I was kind of popping off there. I've been dreaming about this shot for over 365 days. Just let it happen. He's there, he's there, he's there. Oh, let's go! Let's go! Yes, that wasn't anything crazy, but let's go. Oh my god, that was a quad! All these people have so much better settings than I do. So you guys show... Oh my god! I didn't want to spend all of my KR because I figured I'd just like get a few contrabands. I, stupidly, I thought that. Oh my god! 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 No way! No way! Let's go! Leave a like! Leave a like! Oh my god! I broke my chair! Guys! I cannot believe it. That I am I the first person ever to own this item? I am the only person in the world who has this. Let's go. Thank you, Sydney and Vince, for making such an amazing game and being amazing devs. Not gonna lie to you. It's actually pretty fun. Damn. Alright, kid from here. Kid from here. Kid from here. Oh my god, bro. Come on. I just spit all over my monitor. Jesus. So, oh, ho, ho, ho. holy bro, yikes. Oh, oh my, I can't believe what's going on right now. Oh my god, trick shotting in Crunker is forever. Oh. Hey, yo, hey, yo, watch this, watch this. Oh. This game doesn't pass the vibe check. Look at this guy, B hop sliding. Holy. I'm fast as fuck, boy. So fast. Oh! Oh my god, he scared the heck out of me. Fast. Come here, buddy. Get freaked. Uh huh, uh huh. I'm gonna check your yo ass, motherfucker. Wait! And? Come on. Spawn. Can you spawn? I'm waiting. Okay, behind me. Up. Can you spawn here, please? Sir? Sir? Can you spawn? Oh, Shh. Fuck, I messed it up. <laughs> Shit. Does somebody have meek? Can you talk? Hello. Hello. Hablo español. Bihki arabi. Ruski yes. Yo, this kid is actually streaming. Oh my god, this is gonna be so good. I'm gonna troll him. All right, all right. Let's go. Oh, this is gonna be so funny. Hello, Twitch. Hello, Twitch. <laughs> Hello, Twitch. <laughs> my aim, bro. Hello, Twitch. I was just fun speaking game, chef. Are y'all ready for some kill streaks? Cause I'm definitely ready. Holy! Oh, what the fuck was that? Now I understand why I get accused all the time. Alright, let's go. Holy sh! Man. Holy sh! So inside. Y'all not ready for the Konixo, for real. 
y'all tweaking on God? How am I so good at this game? Like, I I just don't understand sometimes. Like, everybody stop to Sorabet. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Hello, wake up. I'm feeling a kill streak right now. Oh my, I'm getting shit on. Spit fire, more like spit absolute shit, fam. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Wait, no, 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 no. What the, what the, what the, what the, 1.1k? <gasps> Thank you for all the follow. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Knock, 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 knock. Huh? <laughs> that, that's like a hundred follow. Oh my god. No, no. <gasps> Bro. Um, Poggers, what up, Clay? Oh. Oh. Oh, clip that. Um, let's open some spins. I have a little bit of KOR. Oh, oh my god! Oh. 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 Yes! Let's go, baby! Yes! Oh, oh, oh. oh my god! Let's go, baby! Oh. Holy sh! Holy sh! Holy sh! Oh my god! Where is Mr. Epic? Mr. Epic, wait, Mr. Epic's inside the point! <laughs> <laughs> is He's this- He's inside the point! He's getting it's free illegal. points! He's just sitting in point, just getting them free <laughs> Imagine not buying the no use spray. I have a- It's 60 KR, bro. Equip it, man, equip it. I'm gonna equip your ass in a second, though. Bro, I don't oh, know. Oh, bro, do that. I got feet, though. That. I think we all have what feet. What is this? I, I, I don't know about you. What is this? Oh my god, right. I'm cracked. I'm cracked I'm out with brain. Crack. Let's go, I'm in here, sick this. Let's go, dude. I'm cracked out of all brain holes. And only for yeah. content, about 340 points, which is unfortunate. Uh, I think Mr. Epic he just went out of the map. <laughs> he went through the little hole. Bro, my pizza's gonna be cold, please. Huh? Let me, let us just win, please. Your pizza? What the fuck you want about you pizza? pizza? Dude, this is more important than pizza, I... man. Fuck your pizza, bro. This means everything to us, dude. Bro, Let's go, we're... sick this. Oh. Ah. I, hey, I don't keep shouting long, bro. I know, dude. I just, oh my I'm self-conscious. Let's bring it up. Let's go. Reporting. I'm getting reported by Ronix, guys. No, no. <laughs> Yo, Let's I go. Get we win. Oh. Let's go. Yo, we did Let's it, go. Dude. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm fucking insane. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god, I am amazing at this game. <laughs> you Holy are, shit. Let's go, baby. Please do not use the alien event <laughs> locations in your matches, everyone. because of me. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Please do not use an alien. <laughs> Is that a rule? I think they were spectating us, dude. <laughs> <laughs> they were. <laughs> oh, shit. They were spectating the shit. They were spectating that. Oh, my God, bro. Why would they <laughs> have spectated us? <laughs> oh, my God. I love it. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Listen. Chat came up with... KR begging dyslexic turds. So apparently you guys are KR begging dyslexic turds now. Fuck, dude. I already fucked it up. I don't even know what I'm fucking supposed to say, dude. I'm not ready for this. I didn't think I was going to fucking do an intro at the beginning of my fucking thing. Okay? Listen. Hold on. Again. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> Re retake. Take. Take two. I screwed up the first time, so. Take two. <laughs> Listen up, you KR. Should I look at it again? KR begging dyslexic turds. No, wait, now there's a. Uh, why did you do that? Porta. Fuck. Fuck. Okay. Trying this again. Screwed it up again because of Porta. Everyone actually blame, Porta. blame Porta. Okay. Take three. What's up, you KR begging dyslexic turds? Okay, in this video, gonna be some nice double nuke gameplay. And then afterwards, I, you know, I felt a little bit lucky. So I did an unboxing, possibly got double contraband back to back. Probably don't believe me, but that's why I gotta stick around until the end of the video so you can see. Before we get into the video, make sure you guys 
like the video, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get notifications for every single time I post a video. Comment down below what you want to see next or if Mr. Epic is a poopy editor because he's a poopy head. Uh, yeah, comment down below that he's poopy head. Frosty Wolf, oh my God. Frosty Wolf got into my fucking game. Is that the real Frosty Wolf? No, 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 no. No way. No, no. Now I have to be in Yeah, now I have to play. I'm dead, bro. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> Appreciate it, brother. Welcome to the fact of chat, my dude. <laughs> now legendary. Later bitch, later bitch, later bitch, later bitch, later bitch, later bitch, later bitch. Did I just hit, bro? Release! Feel free to ask below in the comments. Make sure you guys check out the Twitch, Frosty Wolf, with two underscores after it. Live pretty much every day. Having a great time. Having a great time. No, I, I genuinely want to. I want to. I want to focus on this. Okay. I, all right. Fine. Whatever. Okay. So apparently, someone in your chat said that Crunker is dying. Is that correct? Yep. Or he specifically Frosty should I said? You mean Frosty and his experience dealing with the game and the growth that the game has experienced with zero advertising that it's had? Basically, he said that there's no future. So yeah, I mean, it's the same. How is there no future for Crunker? I'm not. I'm yeah, not I, agreeing. I, I just don't understand how he says that there's no future for Crunker. I'm not do you want to hop in my discord so you can get in or should I just add him to the call so no, so I mean I don't care but listen you need to understand okay that to 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 kind of smash on a game because in a way that's what it's it does have a player retainment it absolutely has a player retainment there's no evidence that you can say that it doesn't have a player retainment, yet there's evidence that I can say that it does have a player retainment. Number one, you have people who are making accounts and people who are grinding. There's a top 100 leaderboards that have been increasing levels ever since like I've been on the game, okay, which has been almost a year now. Uh, probably going to be a year like next month, I believe. Okay, People who don't make accounts doesn't mean that they don't retain the game. This game is played every single day in schools to the point where nearly every school across the entire United States has blocked the school from their from kids using it because kids nowadays in school have access to computers. Um, and they do nothing but play Crunker. Okay, the game has a million daily players, daily players, a million daily players. I would say about three months ago, the max amount of players on at any one time was about 7,000. Now it breaks 20,000. There's absolutely zero, and I mean literally zero advertising for the game other than what content creators make on YouTube and what Twitch play, which Twitch people do. I also will say about two to three months ago, Twitch viewer average um, for the entirety of the category at prime time was... I'd say 350, okay? Now we're breaking 900, okay? We have people who are breaking 2 million and 5 million subs on YouTube who are playing the game, such as Elded, Juan, Barca. We have, um, you can't really take it as like people who have played in the past that are big, that have like Shroud and who really couldn't showcase the game. We've had nearly zero sponsorships for the game, nearly zero advertising, not even on Steam. It's a browser game that people don't even know about unless it's through word of mouth or finding it on YouTube because it doesn't really get recommended to people. 
and yet it is still growing. It still has more players daily than ever. It has more Twitch viewership than ever. When big streamers and stuff find this game, 75% of the time, if they like actually dig into it and kind of realize what Krunker's about, well, actually, actually if, they deal, if they dig into it and see what Krunker's about, it's more like 99% of the time, they're like, where, the, where was this game? Like, never heard of this game. Came out of the blue, right? Game doesn't even have a Steam release. Once it hits Steam, boom, it's going to be driven by ratings, okay? And I guarantee you those ratings, once there's a Steam release, the game's going to be polished off, okay? Ranked is going to be done. Comp rate is going to be done. Uh, comp, comp take rate is going to be uh, better. All this stuff, right? Yeah, there's negatives to the game, but the game is going to have nothing but absolute more growth. And you can't say that the game is dying in any way when FaZe is getting involved with Krunker 2, right? FaZe has their own section for Krunker in their FaZe Discord, which, by the way, the Discord's not new. It's not outdated or old or anything such in the sort, right? Okay? We barely had even any, like, FaZe players play the game. There's a total of eight people in FaZe right now that that are in the FaZe clan in Krunker, right? Verify clan. FaZe has their own section for Krunker. Why would they have that if they don't have plans for it? Right, the game is not dying whatsoever. Is Krunker.io dying? Massive decline as of recently. The issues with hackers, issues with servers, lack of updates. We've actually had a ton of players and content creators quit the game. One of the reasons why I play Krunker is the updates. The updates are frequent and they're also really good quality. Since I started playing the game in April of 2019 until the time I made this video, there has been 60 updates to the game. Some of the updates include really big added features to the game and others are smaller, but they're all designed to take the game in the right direction. To contrast this, Epic Games is known for putting really silly updates to the games, content patches, adding things that everybody doesn't like, like mechs. And they use this as a marketing tactic so they can constantly stay trending on sites like YouTube and other places. So I'm glad that Krunker doesn't do updates just for the sake of updates. 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 But to highlight some of the things that we did get since I started playing, we got the Bowman. The Femis class, the Commando. We got the market update where you can buy and sell. There's been several new maps that have been cycled in and out of the rotation, RIP Kanji. And we now have the beta version of the ranked mode. So I'd say that the updates definitely kept me coming back to the game. New features are being added each and every week, making it possible to customize the game even more. The devs are not scared to let the players have control and tweak their game to exactly how they like it. And that's a true sign of a dev team that not only cares about their community, but has trust and faith for them to really go and expand on the game and make it even better. The next thing I want to talk about is Krunker's community, because it's one of the most vibrant and friendly communities I've ever had the pleasure of being part of. There's something for everyone, be it modders, map slash custom mode makers, skin creators, competitive plays, streamers, content creators, and more. Despite the game being huge in terms of its play count, you still get that small community vibe, be it if you're on the Krunker Bunker Discord, Twitter, Reddit, so on and so on. This is obviously in part because of how fantastic Krunker is as a game, but it's also because Krunker has a seemingly unlimited amount of customization and depth. On top of that, you also have clans where you can meet people and a competitive community which runs tournaments. And Krunker overall has many groups that makes up this community. But all of these groups are friendly and welcoming, which is a very cool thing indeed. Anyways, we, we talked about how we got here. We're so happy that we're here. Let's talk about the future and uh, yeah. So I am not sure what the future holds. I'm gonna make a video more in depth on this tomorrow. A lot of you guys have been asking about Krunker. I'd rather not talk about it in this video because I'm gonna talk about it in the next video, which might be tomorrow, who knows. But I really love Krunker. I love it a lot. And it's a really, really fun game. But what I'll say for the time being is I refuse to upload a game 
that doesn't care enough to update their game. And that sounds really mean and brutal, but honestly, I, I took a little bit of a protest because I was sick of no Crunker updates. I felt like I was making the worst content I have ever made because I had to pull it out of my butt. And I did a little bit of protest. Unfortunately, our YouTube channel got terminated in, in the protest. But you know, months later, weeks, months later, uh, we were promised a, a map uh, a month ago, still not in the game, at least to my knowledge. And it seems like they've added little to nothing to the game to do except a anime waifu bundle. Who cares, dude? I'm sorry. I refuse to upload that game until they update it more. Uh, there's not enough content on that game to make content on it. People aren't interested in it anymore. And it's funny. I, and I am not supposed to be saying these things, but I simply do not care anymore. I love the game and I want the best for the game. And if that's, if this is going to get it there, cool. And if it doesn't, uh, okay, I guess. What is this? I guess this P90 looking thing looks pretty nice, but why would I spend any more money on this game if there's nothing to do in it? Any updates as of recently? Oh, new bundle? New free spin, wow. Check the last update. New skins. Leg shot stat to profile. Map fixes. Man, it's almost like we were supposed to get a map and it still hasn't came out. So as you guys know, I've been uploading Crunker for around two and a half years now, close to three. And the game was always typically getting regularly updated more or less. My thing is as long as the people were interested, I didn't care what was happening. You guys know about Crunker. You guys want to be watching if you if you didn't. And the lobbies are so populated still. Wow! Anyways, Crunker Season 5 came out. And that was supposed to be like the big thing that really saved everything. It is now March. And we've gotten little to no content at all since Season 5. What is the point, dude? Yeah, Crunker Season 5 came out. It was cool at first. Uh, more or less, there is no content in the actual season. Just like a lot of other seasons. And honestly, I'm not going to lie to you guys that was kind of my breaking point crunker season two whatever i could deal with it crunker season four whatever kind of sucks i can deal with it but a crunker season four two or a crunker season two three i can't do that man towards the end of me uploading crunker i really started to feel like i was just like wasting my time and uploading some of the worst content i have ever conjured up not because it was just typically bad content it was really the fact that the game was not getting updated there was nothing new about the game so everything i have already done i already did and there was nothing new to do because there was no new updates. So around a month ago, I decided to take a small break from Crunker. Started to branch out to other things, and obviously my YouTube channel got terminated while we were doing that, so it was a little bit uh, uh, prolonged. But I'm not even gonna lie, uh, exactly what happened is exactly kind of what I thought would happen. I thought maybe, just maybe, they'd take a little bit more initiative on up updating the game. It seems like, if anything, they've stopped caring even more. Now, I want to preface everything I'm saying that uh, by saying I love this game. I, if I could upload this game for the rest of my life i would the game is interesting the game is fun right now the game's fun absolutely no reason to be playing it absolutely no reason to be making videos over it absolutely no reason for anyone to be interested in this game and it really really sucks because i grew my youtube channel so much because of this game and I'll always be grateful for that. I'll always be grateful for the devs of what they've done for me and same with its community. But at the same time, I now have a YouTube channel with 115,000 subscribers and I started Crunker at around 30,000 subscribers. So I gained about 80,000 subscribers and now they just won't be watching my videos because this game is not that popping anymore. I'm not one to call a game dead. I'm not saying this game's dead by any means. I'm saying it's dead due to no content because it's not being updated. You, you really like that, that crunk script update they did last week? Oh, what about the leg shot stat update? You really like that? Yeah, it made me want to play for a few more years. I don't know, man. I, I don't know what the solution is. Not updating the game and not giving people to anything to talk about or do it, it is the, it, it's, it's just bad. That's the thing. Honestly, I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I, I'm going to be very unfiltered this video just because I, I don't see myself having a lot more future with Crunker. I'd love to have one. But this video, along with them not updating the game, probably won't allow that to happen. It really feels like they don't want to be working on this game anymore. Someone who wanted to work on the game would work on the game. There'd be new updates. There'd be maps. And it'd be super duper cool if I was just pulling all of this out of my butt. But I've talked to numerous, numerous map makers who have numerous maps ready to be put in the game. Not good enough, even though Sid okayed it three months ago. It just... It, why would we need a new map? Everyone loves Face It! Why would we ever update the game again? We have Face It now! Oh, season five? No more updates for six months! Woo! I am modern.
moderately upset about the subject. I've got on this game probably three times in the past month. And I'll be honest with you guys, there's a check if they updated the game. And they've maybe updated the game like three times in the past month. And those updates have had no content inside of them. So therefore, there are not being any videos to make. And what I will say, what I will preface this again by saying, the game doesn't need to be made to give us content. The game doesn't need to be made for me to make YouTube videos. The game should be made to allow their player base to have fun and give them something to do. That's the thing I'm more or less stuck on. I'm not thinking about this from like a me perspective. I'm thinking about this from like a community perspective. I've questioned a lot of times asking myself if I really wanted to make this video. Because if all else goes wrong, I just come back to Crunker and pull videos out of my butt every day like I used to. But... I, we deserve better than that, dude. I deserve better than that. You guys deserve better in, in, in terms of you guys need a better game to play. I'm not saying you guys should switch games by any means. I'm not trying to kill this game or anything like that. What I'm saying is this game needs to be treated well it needs to be updated more i'm not saying we need a daily update i'm not even saying we need a weekly update but make updates that will last until the next update don't give us a, a half-assed update to where it's just like here's a bundle i guess have fun playing the same game that hasn't changed in four months that's not fun and whenever i said i deserve better i deserve to make content on a game that's interesting i'd love to make content on this game but god i'm literally just doing anything i can at this point like there's no no updates challenges boring custom games pretty fun to be honest but more or less unimportant for me because i want to play pubs i want to play the game i didn't come to crunker to play custom games i came to crunker to play the game the market it crashed who cares about trading anymore why would i ever trade any of my things again there is no reason for me to come back to this game day by day And on top of that, the content creators, like the YouTubers, we're the ones that primarily bring new players into the game. They see a Crunker IO video, they're like, oh, what's this? And then they start playing the game, right? You don't... I, I, blaming the content creators for the game being unplayable is just weird to me, because we're the ones bringing new people into the game, bro. What is going on, guys? Hugga here. Now, obviously, as you guys can see, we are back on the crunk, which I necessarily don't have a problem with, to be honest with you. I don't mind playing crunker, but it was getting a little bit old. So I did take a, I don't know, I think it was like a three week break or something like that. And I seriously apologize for the lack of uploads in general. I just, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of feeling a weird thing as a content creator right now, where it's like, I, I want to create content, but like, I don't really necessarily want to play games, if that makes sense. So I, I do want to post more variety to my channel just so I don't get burnt out or bored of a specific game, so. What the fuck is up, YouTube? Um, it's been a fucking while. <laughs> it's only been, it's only been like, wow, fucking two years since I've uploaded. Uh, basically, I'm making this video. I have not played fucking Crawl. I haven't uploaded since like 2020. And I don't think I've, I haven't, actually played crunker since before my last crunker upload as you can see like a lot of shit has changed basically uh, i don't know like i just got fucking bored of crunker that's the only thing like i didn't get bored of making videos or anything. i still kind of want to make videos but my hobbies have changed over time i literally have not played a fucking video game in god knows how fucking long Uh, it's it's been a really long time since you've probably seen me on YouTube. If you didn't know, my last YouTube upload was in August of 2021. Ah, no! And I've uploaded nothing since then. You're probably wondering where I've been, what I've been doing, why I haven't uploaded. And I figured I'd make this video to give you that update, let you know what's been happening and, and what I've been doing. Pretty much what happened was last year in about July, the place I live, Sydney, Australia, went through one of the biggest lockdowns that was happening in the world. We were only allowed to leave five kilometers from our front doorstep. I was not allowed to leave my suburb, which means, you know, I couldn't see friends or family. I couldn't go to work, nothing like that. I was effectively shut in at my house. When that happened, I decided to take the jump and attempt to do full-time content creation streaming. And when I first started doing that, I was streaming eight hours a day, six days a week of just pure crunker content. And that meant, you know, just pumping out pubs all day or customs all day, you know, drops would come around every once in a while and, and, and numbers would go crazy crazy. I very quickly experienced burnout or fatigue. This was prior to when ranked launch. Yeah, like all I all I did 
every stream was just run pubs or run customs. And if you don't know this, if you're not a Kronker streamer, you don't realize this, but running custom games uh, actually kills your stream during the custom game because everyone's actually playing your custom game and not chatting in chat or they have to shut down the stream because they can't play and watch at the same time. You know, I was kind of like in a weird spot where I was burning out, I was fatigued, uh, but at the same time, I was also like actively harming my channel by trying to make my streams half pubs and half uh, custom games. And it was around that time that I decided to try and experiment with other categories uh, and try and find something that works. And one of those games I tried uh, was Grand Theft Auto V, but specifically the roleplay division, which is where you make a character and you pretend to be that character. And as cringy as it sounds, it's probably the biggest category on Twitch right now with people like Summit1G uh, getting involved in, and making their own characters and stuff like that. So I swapped over to it and I went sort of full time uh, with that. I guess just naturally my stream went from being, uh, you know, initially when, when I started playing GTA, it was like 80% Kronker, 20% GTA. Then it was like 50% Kronker, 50% GTA. And then it was like 20% Kronker, 80% GTA. And then one day it just became 100% GTA. And uh, that is what I've primarily played since I would say August of last year, maybe July. I wake up, turn the stream on, jump into some GTA, do anywhere from like six to 12 hour streams and go to bed and rinse and repeat the next day. All right, listen. So basically, basically, it's been pretty obvious. It's been pretty obvious, all right? Actually, seriously, genuinely, uh, statistically obvious. Uh, obviously, I haven't been streaming Crunker a lot. I haven't been streaming in general a lot. You know what I'm saying? And I advertise daily streams, by the way. And I probably stream like, I want to say like 12 times out of 20 days in December, which is not good at all. Um, first and foremost, we killed 2020, which I'm very happy about. Uh, second off, we're, we're, we finished with our main YouTube channel goals. You know what I'm saying? We got the full 4,000 hours thanks to you guys and all the support. And uh, we applied. And uh, obviously, it's going to take about 30 days to actually go through and get accepted, which is kind of unfortunate. I wish it was earlier. I really wanted to get it before 2021, but it is what it is. We finished our goal. We got it. We applied. We just got to get accepted, all right? Uh, we'll wait the 30 days or however long it takes. Uh, other than that, uh, the streams haven't been very often, all right? And uh, I just want to say something. I just want to let you guys know that I'm kind of taking a break with Krunker. I, I mean, you guys have seen it. I've been playing Valorant a lot more. I've been playing Apex a lot more. Just any game in general other than Krunker, even just chatting in general, you guys know this. And I, I mean, I'm not taking a full-on break. Like, I'm still going to try and create content for you guys. If anything, like, I'll play customs for like an hour or something. But I, I don't know, man. There's just so many fucking hackers, dude. Like, I don't have fun. I don't have fun, dude. It's, I'm not having fun. I love the game to death. They're just so many hackers. And I'm aware, like, I'm 100% aware, bro. Like, I 100% respect, like, respect everyone on the devs and everything like that. But, like, bro, there's so many fucking hackers, man. And I just want to say quickly before this video starts that I am sorry that I have not uploaded in three to four weeks. Um, the reason I have not uploaded in three to four weeks will be in this video. Um, I just want to say that I am terribly, terribly sorry. I know you guys have been wanting to see new content coming out for me. But like I said, you guys will see why I haven't been posting in this video. So uh, yeah, let's not waste any more time and get right into the video. Alrighty, boys. So let's go ahead and start it off with how um, I feel about Krunker. So, Krunker is at a state right now that I do not enjoy. I do not enjoy playing Krunker um, as I used to. I've been playing Krunker for about five to six months now. And it, don't get me wrong, it's been such a fun time. But by the fourth to fifth month, Krunker is starting to get really, really boring in my opinion. And I'm just not enjoying it. I'm not having fun with it. And the reason I haven't been posting content on YouTube is because I just haven't been enjoying the game whatsoever. Hey guys, what's going on? It's up to start in today's video. I'm explaining to y'all. Well, just me telling y'all. It's true, I got tired on Krunker.io. It's whatever, to be honest. Krunker needs to fix their game. Um, the reason... I got tagged using to quit the game and did some TIS stuff. I mean, I should be banned. I do deserve the ban. 
but this video is just going to be me ranting about Krunker. Krunker needs to fix their game because the hackers are rampant and there's no comps in the game. Everyone is just quitting. The whole comp community cheats. The, the whole comp scene cheats. Hope y'all know that. I could expose so many people right now, but I'm not going to. But the whole comp community cheats and Krunker is kind of on the decline. And I think it's going to die in the next six months. The content creators are quitting. Sorbel's new video, Sorbel is talking about quitting the game quit uploading it because literally there's no content in the game they haven't updated it since season five and season five is when they promised us with content so yeah i just want to give you all a little update now i'm just gonna play some memories i had on Krunker. it's really whatever i am tagged love y'all this is the last time i'll ever talk about it i won't bring it up ever again peace out Hello, um, I've just watched Sorbo's new video, um, this isn't going to be edited, this is going to be like a straight up raw thing, yeah, as you, like, bro, it, it's, it's scuffed as fuck, but I, I need to address this, like, I've seen too many, I'm just going to play, I'm just going to play while this is, like, doing it, because I, I need to talk about this, um, Krunker is on a very, very slippery slope, and I think that the game will be dead within six months. Like, deleted, gone, servers closed. Um, there have been no content updates in since the start of Season 5. Season 5 would, was promised to be a very content-packed season, which, yes, it was. They added challenges, they added raids, they added face-it, they added a lot of cool stuff. Um, catering towards new players, there was nothing. Raids was quite cheesable, it was quite easy to do. Um, anyone could really do it if you had a team, and they kept nerfing it, and nerfing it, and nerfing it after people were cheesing it. Understandable by the devs, but that killed raids, and I don't think they care, realize, I don't know. I'm probably going to get banned for this video, I, I don't know, but I feel like I really need to address this, because Krunk is dying, um, CCs are leaving, it's very obvious, like, face embeds, Krunk embeds, every, every type of embed is, like, buffed to the fucking max. You see streamers on like 200 viewers, but actually there are like two viewers. I'm not going to say any names because I don't like embarrass or like anything, but like my own stats, like half of my views are from crunk embeds and it's just embarrassing because like, like months ago I used to look at my crunker or well, like my views, like I saw my view count on, which don't do it if you stream and have view count on. Um, I basically had my view count on and I would see I'd be like 30, 40, 50 view. It would just keep going up. And I, I'm, like, so happy to, like, oh, my God, yes, my views are going up. Um, I, I must be doing good on Twitch. No, I, I wasn't. I, I was doing the opposite. I was actually declining in views. Crunk is dying, but views on Twitch say otherwise purely because the embeds are carrying the, the category. It says it's, like, 600 viewers, but at least half of that is embeds. At least half. There's about 300 viewers on Twitch peak. Meaning there are not many CCs playing, which is sad because they're all quitting, they're all going to other games. Like, I'm probably going to Minecraft or Roblox, I don't know. I haven't planned it yet. Um, there's countless twit longers of people leaving the game, quitting, doing all this stuff. And watching Sobo's latest video and seeing how just sad he looks and how he's been making content for this game for like, I don't know how long, like a few years, like three, I don't know. And you just see the quality of content just declining because there's just nothing to make content on when you've done it all and obviously like me being me yes i haven't uploaded like any youtube content because bitch like i stream but like it's just gonna be the same content and there's nothing crunker is adding nothing crunker is adding also also the hacker situation holy shit this game is only four years old and they don't have a stable enough hacker anti-cheat what the fuck like there's literally hacker in my game right now there's hacker in my game right now and there's a skin package right there. Oh my fuck. Anyway. That was a drunk package. But anyway. Face anti G, it's just so many of these things. Like I I truly believe the devs are trying to kill their own game or they just don't care. Just tell us. It's in Sorbo's video. He said just tell us if you you stopped doing this game or something. Cause you keep every player left in the dark of any update. Any player is left in the dark. And it's just so depressing because like, you, you don't know what update you're going to have next. The Krunker roadmap. People are so excited to see survival mode, 
face anti-cheat. All of this, gone. They literally deleted the roadmap because they knew they couldn't stick to it. Pay more devs. Like, you literally just... Oh my god, you literally posted an NFT project. You posted all these NFTs. Like, there was Crunk Town. I don't know, like, the plots. Crunker plots. And that, it looked like a good idea. But I don't think there's any map maker that's going to be adding to it. Because it's just not worth it anymore. Like, I saw in this video, all the comments, five maps. They said five maps were suggested, like, to be added. And the, and the devs could literally add it. And all they're doing is reworking maps. I don't know what... Bro, the devs are bugging, bro. <laughs> they're bugging. Like, bro, I, I'm, I'm not trying to shit on them. Oh, I mean, I am, but I'm not. But, like, they're bugging. Like, there are thou literal thousands of suggestions in Crunker Bunker right now. Thousands just sitting there. The devs could just do something content. Just something. But, dude, like, I literally I made a tweet longer on this. I mean, yes, it's not like the devs are going to see it, but they need to make the game more friendly for new players. More friendly for new players. This guess is literally about to get nuke, but it needs to be friendly towards new players. And I think the game just needs to be less petty, if that makes sense. And like, give all CCs KPD. Um, I know the big ship situation. I know like Shem situation. All this that happened. I'm gonna leave this lobby. And yes, these are things that happen, but that's not our fault. That shit in KPD, shit, all this. Not not even KPD. I don't even know what it is, but. If shit gets leaked, it's normal, it happens in games. I would rather see CCs with KPD than see them fucking suffer to the hands of cheaters and they have to keep leaving games and it just fucks up their experience. Bro, the CCs are the fucking backbone of Kronka community. They are legit the backbone. Not Kronka drops. That does fuck all. That does nothing. Like, you're just giving free items to the players to keep them happy. I'm, I'm sorry, but that is the hard truth. There is no other way about it. I don't want to shit on this game. And I know there's probably going to be someone watching this being like, oh my god, Nokia, what are you doing? You're literally going to... Bro, I've been in this game for nearly four years. Three and a half years. I haven't verified three and a half years in this game. I've seen the game from go from nothing to everything to nothing again. This game is legit less popular than what it was when it was first thing. When it was first thing. I remember they, they needed to do updates with their constant servers. They had to keep adding to those because they were just new players. There's something else. And... Right, I made a whole new tweet longer on this. I don't want to keep this video long. I'll probably get end it here. But um It's it's like right now, right, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna load up. I'm gonna load up my comment that I done so real This basically summarized everything. This? Oh my yeah, this basically summarized everything. I need to get all this out of the way. Um this was my comment. You have a right to be angry. Um it's not your fault. All CCs are suffering because there's no content updates. Um so many CCs are leaving, going to other games. Like, I, like I, I'm not saying I'm not saying names. Junkyard Tuesdays last last ditch attempt. Um, obviously, no content. The devs need to work together. That's just, bro. Like, the devs need to work together. It's it's so dumb. Like, I spoke to very high up people recently, and they said the devs are just working on their own thing. What are you doing? Um, there's not much CCs left, so it's not fun for players. They can't. There's no one for them to watch. Um, Everyone is left in the dark. They need updates. Um, they did a let let me let me open this real quick. Let me open this real quick. Um, they did right. So Sydney did an announcement, and he says um, it may seem like content has slowed down. Oh shit! It may seem like content has slowed down. This because with overhaul on lobbies, anti cheat balancing, and Chrome script. What part of that is new content, bro? What part? Pick Sydney. Pick. Lobbies, wow, we have this. I, we don't want wager matches. We don't want this. Bro, if I am putting a wager into a fucking lobby and there's a cheater, I'm not going to play. No one's going to wager that shit. No one's got KR, bro. Um, Crunk script, we don't care because no one's making maps and no one even uses Crunk script. Everyone just plays pubs. Pubs or customs. And most of, most of the customs, people don't want this fancy shit. Balancing, we don't care. Anti-cheat. We care, but every update we see is like anti cheat fix, anti cheat, anti cheat, anti cheat. Nothing has been fixed. We've had hackers for like four years in this game, bro. It's not going. It's not going, bro. It is a browser game. You're not gonna have an anti cheat in a browser game. Good luck. You you're not gonna do it. hack clients, closet cheated, bro. So many high level players right now are cheating. But guess what? They're not gonna be banned. They're not gonna be banned because I I I'm not saying the reason. Um. The game just looks very tacky. I really don't upload this. I really don't upload this, but 
I have to, bro. I, dude, I care so much about this fucking game. I don't want to quit. I don't want to quit. I've already quit like two times in the past because I thought the game was going to die. I thought the game was going to die, so I was like, okay, I cannot die with the ship. I need to go. What are you doing? Um, weekly updates are not possible. You're going to fuck off every player in the game right now. Why are we working on huge changes like this? These are not huge changes. No one gives a fuck about rebalancing classes. I'm sorry. No one cares. We just need content. We just need content. What are you doing? I, I can't. Bro. I can't. I can't. Like, I'm probably going to get tagged. I'm probably going to get banned. Um, it's not going to make a difference. Tagging me, it's not going to make a difference to your game. Um, adding new maps is not going to do shit. I think, yes, it's nice. It's refreshing. Yeah, new map. We've played the map 10 times. It's boring. Next. You need content that people can unlock. Look at fucking Roblox, bro. Bad business. Look at other games. What are they doing? Like, you need to add more classes. Like, oh my, I can't. I, I'm going to have to end the video here. Um, I'm going to go all out, bro. Somewhere. Not on stream. I don't know. I care too much about this game. I want Kronka to do good. Listen to your community. Your community knows best. Um... I know you might think you you know what you're doing. I personally think the devs need a manager. If Sydney's the manager, do something because Krunk is going to die. And Krunk is something I've never seen a game like this before. Um, the devs used to be so close with the community. Um, going in people like going in streams like Frosty Wolf and you would see Sydney in a call with Frosty Wolf and the community would be fucking thriving. You'd see everyone so excited for these updates and they did it, bro. They did the updates. Like infected. High and sick like this was shit people were excited for. They do an update, no one cares, bro. No one cares. It's not the community. It's just they're just pissed off. They like we're literally just demanding what we should have had months ago. You need to catch up. Um all of these comments are literally just agreeing. I'm not going to say any names, but you can just read them and just see that they, they're all agreeing. I'm going to end it there. Um, I'm sorry I made this video. I don't want to do this. I know it's not edited. Um, I don't care. Um, I think you should see the entire raw thing. Yeah. Um, I'm probably not going to make a video like this again. I don't know what. what. I just need to do this. Um, goodbye, Kronka Devs. Please listen to your community, especially those that are OG, verified, the people that care about your community. Goodbye. I'll say it. Like, actually say it. So if y'all don't know, my take on Frosty quitting Crunker. It, it's understandable, dude. Like, it's really understandable. If you guys don't know already, Frosty Wolf is quitting Crunker for the, for the reason being... It's not because of the devs. It's not because of the game. It's not because of the state of the game. It's none of that. Whatever you assume it is, it, it's none of that. The main reason being is because of the community and how, um, let's just say, let's just say how childish in a sense, kind of childish in a sense, to where, uh, you have people come in the chat and say, hey, man, you're my favorite streamer, dude. I love watching your streams, dude. And then you'll stream another game. For example, for me in this situation would be Scary Saturdays. I have people come in on Scary Saturdays and say, Hey man, like, play Crunker, dude. Why are you watching scary videos, man? And y'all know, like, I've never not watched a scary video while I stream on Saturday night or Sunday morning. Like, uh, Scary Saturdays is here to stay. It's not going anywhere. Um, and in his case, you know, he plays Valorant. You know, he plays Rocket League. He plays all sorts of games. He's a variety streamer, man. He plays Genshin Impact, you know? Uh, and obviously, his YouTube's pretty much crunker. He has one Genshin Impact video. And the fact that people come in there, they'll say, Hey, you're my favorite streamer, man. I love your stream so much. And then they'll just say, Hey, why are you not playing crunker the next day? It's kind of just like, it's just a slap to the face. It's just like, damn, like these people are kind of just lying to my face. They're, they're saying that, you know, I'm their favorite streamer. And they would watch me play anything, but they don't. They just say they hate this game. They don't like this game. They just want to see me play Crunker. And that's not what he wants in this community. Which is completely understandable, man. Completely understandable. I mean, at the end of the day, man, like, everyone wants to be a full-time streamer. Everyone wants to be, you know, just, just watching YouTube videos. Just watching, you know, playing their favorite game. Regardless if it's Crunker, regardless if it's another game. Everyone wants to play, it, like, their favorite game on stream. That's the goal. Is to obviously make a living doing what they enjoy. So... It's kind of more like of a, 
it's more of like a future move. It's more like, you know, I, I should do this now before it's too late and I can't really make a move and everyone just expects nothing but Krunker. It, he's kind of making the the move like beforehand so he doesn't need to do it in the future. Which obviously a lot of people eventually will make that move, which I don't blame them. I don't blame them. I mean, I get it. I literally get it. And I'm sure other streamers too, like Zed, like Ted's. I'm sure a bunch of them do as well. Like, I don't blame them. So, um, that's just my take. I don't blame him. The game's fantastic the way it is. I want to kill these guys, please. Uh, the game's fantastic the way it is. I don't blame anyone. And, um, I hope for the best for him, man. Seriously. If it wasn't for Christopher, uh, I would probably not have what I have today, dude. It's insane how much he's helped me out. It's actually insane. The man's helped me out so, so much, man. Like, he's practically... He was the first Krunker streamer I ever watched. Like, ever. Ever. Um, that's so loud, dude. He was the, f he was the first Krunker streamer I ever watched. And, um... You know, it's just awesome. It's awesome to see him blow up, obviously. Uh, it's awesome, you know, to see that we've all blown up together. Moon Juice, uh, Zed, you know what I'm saying? All those, the Waspy as well. Like, when I started streaming Krunker, everyone was sitting at, like, 30, 40 viewers. And to see that everyone sits at, like, hundreds of viewers every single day is insane, man. Absolutely insane. So, I'm just proud of everyone. I'm just proud of everyone. And, um, it's sad to see him go, obviously. But, at the end of the day, you know, he's making the right choice for himself. Imagine like 15 little Dobbies hooked up on crack cocaine coming in my chat and saying, you should stream Krunker or stream Krunker. Stream Krunker. That's all you're good for. Or, hey, can I have your shit since you quit Krunker? And I said, you know what, dude? These kids. Okay. Because honestly, bro, I was going to wait for a Steam market. But personally, I don't think that's ever going to fucking happen. And I'm literally tired of people asking in my chat, stream Krunker. Can I have your crunk items, please? Please give me your crunk items, Frosty. Okay. In other words, all you crunker kids, I hope you perish in hell. Okay. <laughs> There's no. Boop, 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 boop. boop, boop, boop. Are you in sure? other words, all of you guys, fuck yourselves. Okay. Not giving shit to any of you. This shit out of Stram if you want some free shit now. Because this probably makes him. The richest person in Krunker, without a fucking doubt. Uh, we had that coin flip that we did like a billion years ago that I kind of whooped Strems' his ass on and took his vertigo virginity. I put him through enough hell. I even thought about quick selling it uh, when I had it, when I had two, because that would have been funny as shit, okay? To make it then be like, what, four or five in vertigos left? But I said that eventually drum has got his vertigo back i got a ghosty but now i barely play this game anymore right i honestly just don't care about skins at all like i'm just i know i spent a lot of money on this game but i'd rather just completely put my time and focus elsewhere so i am giving shrimps this shit to make him uh more addicted to the game than he already is uh, even though I told him he needs to branch out because he's a little fucking gremlin. Okay. And yeah. All of you guys, all you crunker kids are coming in my chat. I hope you step on a fucking Lego. Are you like, are you 100% sure? If you don't click ready, I'm going to leave this lobby. Okay. Your mom smells like cheese. Crunker, no. Oh my. Ugh. Crunker, ew.
the game made you? I don't give a fuck if the game made me, bro. Oh, wait, actually, no. Fuck the game. The game didn't make me. Me playing the game didn't fucking make me. Let's get this shit fucking straight for a second, brother. Let's get this shit fucking straight, all right? You think that fucking game made me? You think the fact that I posted fucking video after video after video on YouTube didn't fucking make me? You think that me streaming fucking hours on hours on hours of time doing 24 hour fucking streams that didn't fucking make me but it was the game that made me brother if you honor that you are on a fucking load piling shit of fucking misinformation stupidity hey brother holy fuck there's no fucking shot that you are over the age of 12 if that is your fucking mindset there's no way that you have the maturity to even fucking think that there's no fucking way brother i think you need to reevaluate what streaming means and what twitch means as a whole brother all right because you are missing some fucking brain cells brother holy shit dude actually yeah waspy said it i think he made me fucking tier 125 months i fucking love you waspy yo check trade yo get the fuck out of my chat tiktok all right beer beat let me uh do these push-ups I kind of feel it a little bit, but obviously I'm a good enough player to where it doesn't matter. Do you think Crunker's getting too hard in pubs? Guys, face it's out early! We're playing competitive! People are playing over here like their lives are on the line! Man, that $30,000 is gonna do you well, huh? It, it, sniper AK doesn't matter. The range doesn't matter. What's happening does I could be 16 miles away trying to snipe you, and you're gonna go across the map. The bullets are gonna fly! Hit my head! I'm dead immediately! My sniper bullet going at max velocity! Flying at 6,000 miles per hour! Hits you in the head! Right in the forehead! And you go, uh, and then you go, with your AK, I'm dead! I have like another video coming out this week as like a retrospective on like ranked, how it's gone for like the whole season. Not gonna lie to you, there's sometimes when the things are bad. Like, you know, uh, you know that, 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 that clip of me punching my chair? <laughs> yep. <laughs> that was Face It. Uh, I have like a little over 200 games played in rank, so I've played You're quite crazy, a- crazy, man. I actually really like it. It's pretty fun. I mean, like, you, it, it has its, like, you know, ups and yeah. downs, but I've had a lot of fun with it. I, like, don't think I'll ever play Face It again. I'm serious. Like, I think from that one game, I genuinely do not think I will ever play Face It again unless alting is actually legal then i'll make an alt and i'll have fun on the game but if it's not legal then i should be able to make an alt since literally everyone else in the game is making an alt either fucking make sure people aren't using alts or also maybe since it's face it and supposed to have anti-cheat maybe enable the anti-cheat and make it enforced instead of it being fucking optional who thought that was a good idea who 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 okayed that ruins the experience i was so excited for face it the entire time it was uh, being made the entire year just for it to come out just for me to not be able to play it i won two matches ever because you you match me up against level 10s who are on the brink of diamond fucking fix the game mode dog please it's it's, it's so unfun it's by far one of the least uh, Anyways, chat, probably should stop talking before I get in trouble. Most of my experiences, at least in uh, open beta, I guess this is, or is it in beta or is it out? No, this is season one. This is like the whole, okay. this is the real deal, yeah. Well, ever since like open beta slash official release, I don't know why my experience has been ever so slightly awful. Um, I've won three matches this season. I've probably played five, maybe six, seven. Um, I just, dude, every game, it's either, um, alts or, I don't even think hackers is a big issue, but I've been playing against some alts who are hitting some shots that should not be possible. Like, uh, one person who is getting shot at by all four of my teammates who I know are competent, 
uh, and he's killing all four of us before we could get him to dead. So, I don't know, man. I, I just, I want to play the game mode. I just genuinely have a terrible time every time I play it. These guys are playing way more aggressively than I ever would have expected. Oh, I'm yeah. I'm very confused. Level 16s have somehow gotten a lot better since Face It came out. Oh, yeah. It's like Who would have thought? Teammates right there. Got one. Took me out. Dang. They're really good at holding that point. Maybe Just go right here on next. Work. Yeah, I uh, I don't think I'm even going to go for these uh, wins for the rewards as much as I'd love to. I just don't have the mental capacity <laughs> to uh, play that much face it, unfortunately. I will lose me mind, bro. Hey, uh, sorry, bro. The joke is still being built. Keep scrolling. <laughs>